to the Macbeth. My name is Lennon and I'll be your maitre d' for this evening. Please enjoy a glass of wine. We'll start going and retrieve your starter from the chef. What ho, my merry listeners. My name, for which I am given, is Tarquinius. And this is the news from where thou art, Shakespearean special. Welcome to this bounteous special edition of the News From Where Thou Art, as we focus this week on Shakespeare the Bard. It's all about me, you know. So, first off, let's join Eleanor and Lennon as they serve us up a feast to remember. And today we have a really, really simple, easy recipe to do, which you can do at home too. So let's get started. Double duck. Toil. And travel. Fire burn, cold and hot. Fillet of a fine steak. In the cauldron, boil and bake. I meat and toe of frog. Pull it back and tell the dog. Adder's fork and blind one sting. Lizard's legs and owlet's wings. For a charm of powerful trouble, light a hell of boil a bubble, dummy and double, toil and trouble, fire burn and cold bubble. And so we just have to let this sit for about three minutes. So let's turn the timer here and just let it brew basically. You can smell, it smells so good. So here we have it, a lovely, really, really simple recipe which you can do at home. With compliments from the chef, we hope that you enjoy your stay at the Macbeth. Gad zooks, that looketh a right old feast. So let's move now to Tame and to Jacob and their take on the Merchant of Venice. He hath disgraced me, and hindered me half a million. Laughed at my losses, mocked at my gains. Scorned my nation, thwarted my bargains. Called my friends, heated my enemies. And what's his reason? I am a Jew. Hath not a Jew's eyes, hath not a Jew's hands. Organs, dimensions, senses, passions. Fed by the same food, hurt by the same weapons. Subject to the same diseases, healed by the same needs, warmed and cooled by the same summer and winter a Christian is. If you prick us, do we not bleed? If you tickle us, do we not laugh? And if you poison us, do we not die? And if you wrong us, Shall we not revenge? For my revenge, the vin me you teach me, I will execute, and it shall go hard, for I will better the instruction. And now we come to a Midsummer Night's Dream with Constance, Annabelle, Chris and Aston, and you're in for a real treat, or else me a liar call. Over hill, over nail, through bush, through briar, over park, over pale. Through flood, through fire, I do wonder everywhere, swifter than the northern sphere. And they say of the fairy queen, did you hear orbs upon the green? Thou speakest aright. I am that merry wonder of the night. I jest to Oberon and make him smile, when I have fat and bean fed horse beguile. Neighing in likeness of a filly foal, and sometimes lurk I in gossip's bowl, in likeness of a roasted crab. And when she drinks, from her lips I bob. And on her withered dew that bore the ale. The wisest tongues, telling the saddest tale. Sometimes three foot stool mistaketh me. And then from her bum I slip and she topples. And Taylor cries and falls into a cough. And the whole choir hold their hips and laugh. And then waxen, 
knees and smurf and swear. Never a merrier hour was wasted there. Baru, fairy, here comes Oberon. What? What? What do you see? Do you see an ass's head of your own? You are changed. Why did they run away? I see their game. They're trying to make an ass out of me. T'was in a restaurant that they met, Romeo and Juliet. Romeo had no bill to pay the debt, so Romeo'd what Juliet. Now we're about to look at some of the new Disney and Pixar franchises of Romeo and Juliet, Hamlet, Macbeth, with Ava, Blake, Caitlin and Camille. Enjoy. Soft. What light through yonder window breaks? Is it the It is the east, and Juliet is the sun. Arise, fair sun, and kill the envious moon, who is already sick and pale with grief. O oh, Romeo, Romeo, wherefore art thou, Romeo? Deny thy father, and refuse thy name. O oh, heaven, revenge is foul and most unnatural murder. Murder, murder, most foul as in the best it is, but this, most foul, strange and unnatural. Haste, haste. To be or not to be, that is the question. Whether it is nobler in the mind to suffer the slings and arrows of outrageous fortune, or to take arms against a sea of troubles, and by opposing, end them. And now, to a modern version of the dream, with Jacob and his sister. A group of Athenians gathered in a pub to celebrate Duke Theseus's wedding. One of the actors, called Bottom, was talking to a friendly bartender. Hello, I'm Puck, the mischievous bartender. Hi, um, get me a drink so I can shove and show all of my friends your finest mead. Uh, cheers. Zooms, is that the hour? Well, I must make haste and bid you adieu. If we shadows have offended, think but this, and all is mended. For next week a new challenge will appear for you to send in to us to air. Farewell and good night. I think my moustache is grown. Well, it's jolly nice to be remembered. Thanks for watching. Thank you.